upon a few thousand diapers late. That mistake you thought he made covers up the refrigerator. Oh, yeah. And he Hi, welcome back. I'm in my tall, so I'm doing a tall video today. But it's gonna be a good one. I've been wanting to do this for a while, but you can see I couldn't get this item for a long time because every time I went, it was unavailable. And they told me they would get more in November, so I, I went today and they got them. So I'm gonna share with you guys. So, today's video is going to be a comparison between two things, two items, and my take on which one is better. So, and I'm also filming in two parts, so tomorrow, the next part you might see me in a different clothes because I had to wait for the next day because one of the items is not open on Sunday, so, yeah. So, before we get into the detail, let me do some housework for you y'all. If you are new to this channel and this is your very first video, smash that subscribe button right now. And make sure you turn on that bell notification because you do not want to miss my epic adventure, my awesome idea that I won't share until I share the video because I don't want to take them. And just enjoy life. Give this video a big thumb up if you just want to have fun. Just want to have fun. And comment down below, what do you think the two items that we are going to be comparing and waiting in the video on? Comment down below. And with that, let's get right into this. So, I'm going to be comparing Popeye New Spicy Session Sandwich with the spicy session dairy from Chick fil -A. But unfortunately, I'm filming this on a Sunday and Chick fil -A is not open. So that's why I'm saying I'm gonna have to film this in two parts so I might wear different clothes. Because it's gonna be two different days. So, um, you're gonna see me cry both sandwiches and wait both sandwiches and then at the very end, compare the two and see which one is really the better end of the deal. Is it Chick-fil-A or is it Popeye? And also before we get into any of that, comment down below what do you think will be better? Popeye sandwich or Chick-fil-A? Or what one would you do why? Chick-fil-A or Popeye? So with that being said, let's get right into it. So I have the Popeye sandwich right here. It smells good. It smells really good, though. Really good. Um, it kind of looks like... Oh, the pistol on it. It kind of looks like the Chiffre, but the bread is a little different. And the Shishin is more crispy than Chiffre. Like, rough, not smooth. You can kind of see it. It has like the whipple thing. But the bread is definitely different than Chick-fil-A. Oh, and also, I I could be a little biased on this because I love Chick-fil-A. Chick-fil-A is probably my favorite fast food place in America right now until I fly any of the one in the, on the West Coast. Then I don't have any of those on the West Coast because I live in the Northeast, so that's sad because I really want to fly them, but I can't because they're all like 20 hours away. Eventually, one day I would take you die and we would go fly some fast food, good places on the West Coast. So stay tuned. But until then, Chef Play is definitely my favorite. And I just want to see why everybody is craving this sandwich. Like, is it really better than Chef Play? I don't know. Let's take a bite.
you can definitely take the spice. Not right away, but it's after after you like chew it a little bit, you can definitely take the spice. And you can definitely tell that the chicken is more fried than Chick-fil-A. I think that's what you would say, right? Fried chicken. And also, a big thing is, they don't want to put a lot of things on it, so this is literally just bread, the chicken, and pistol. That's literally what it is, as I can see. So there's not a lot of things on here. I think Chick-fil-A come with lettuce, tomato, chicken and bread, I think. Something like that. So there's less um, item on this sandwich. So you're pretty much just tasting a bite of a session with bread. It definitely, it's good, what I, but I'm not gonna really talk about how I'm gonna pair with the Chipotle until I eat that one too. But, it's good, I'm not sure if I'm gonna buy it again. Like, I mean like, I would probably buy it again, I mean, I probably won't buy it like, everything a day or like, everything a week or something like that, maybe like once a month or maybe once every two months or something like that. Um, but it's not bad. Like, I would recommend all of you to go try it because it, it is good. It's just, I don't know. It's probably because I do like Chick-fil-A a lot, so that's probably why, but it's not bad. It's not bad. Um, if I had to rate it out of 10, I would probably give it a 7.5. Um, because again, it's... Even though it's called a spicy chicken sandwich, it's not really spicy until like the aftertaste and then you start getting the bite. But like when you're eating it, it's not that spicy. So I feel like Chipotle have advantage on that because Chipotle, you, it is spicy. Like you can definitely tell that one's spicy without even eating it. Um, I mean like, you know what I mean. But this one, is, it's not really spicy until the aftertaste. So that definitely that it behind, but I I like what they're doing. Like I think having a chicken sandwich is good. Um, not bad. So honestly, I think I think I give it a B a B plus and a seven point five rating. So let's go into. Oh hey guys, um, I'm gonna I'm finishing this video that I started yesterday. So you just saw me uh, in the last clip crying and talking about the Popeye new session spicy sandwich. So I decided to do a comparison thing, and so I went to Chef Filet, which is my favorite fast food in my opinion. Like Popeye good, but Chef Filet really good. And I'm gonna try the spicy chicken there from Chick-fil-A and see which one do I like better. Popeye, Chick-fil-A. So, I already did the info, so I'm just gonna jump right into this. So, the one thing different, Chick-fil-A, um, I got to the lock, so I didn't get that the spicy chicken there, I got to the, the lock, so it's more tough on it. But so the, the lock come in a box, 
I think the other one come in a bag. And white right off my top of my head, I can definitely see some different. The Popeye ones did not come with lettuce, did not come with cheese or tomatoes. Um, the chicken looked a little smoother and not like rough like uh, Popeye would one. And the bread, the bread is different too. Bread is, yeah. So with all that being said, let's get right into this. I'm gonna take the full bite and see which one better. Mm. Mmm. Okay. That bite was delicious. Um, there was definitely a lot of flavor in that. A lot of juicy flavor, which I didn't really doubt that from Popeye. Like, when I mean juicy, I mean the good stuff. I'm gonna go back in for a second bite. Yeah, the sushi in this is outrageous. Part of the back one. There's just more flavor to this one too. Yeah, I definitely can uh, tell you like that. The flavor and the sushiness is way better than Popeye's, but they are pretty similar. Like, if you like spicy sushi sandwich, you can go to either one and still have a good quality sandwich to take by day. They're both good. They did a. Let's, let's give them both a round of applause. Said, I give a thumb up for both of them. They were both good. I would definitely go and buy another sandwich from both places. But Chipotle is my favorite by far. But Popeye, like, right up with them. Um, it's good. Yeah. Okay, guys, so that one me flying the Popeye Spicy Damage and the AAA Damage. Um, comment down below if I buy you guys to go out and try it on your own and then you do your own comparison. Also, comment down below if you want more type of the video. Like, comment down below what product you want me to compare and I will do it for you guys. Um, I think the video is nice. And also, comment down below if you have any other like food idea videos that you want me to do. All the way up to you, your suggestion. I want to make you guys happy, so yeah. And also, before we go, give the video a big thumb up. Find your magic moment, y'all. And before we get into the random dancing to slow down the video, I just want to, I just want you guys to remember, you are worth it. Just remember that you are worth it. Um, believe in yourself. 
You are unique, you are beautiful, and you can do whatever you want in life. If you have something on your mind, or you have something that you've been wanting to get done for so long, do it. Do it now. Start, start on it now. Don't give up. Don't play on the back button. Start it now. You won't regret it. It will accomplish in your life whatever you want to do. Until they even make a job out of it. Life is about being happy and about being yourself. And listening to yourself with help from your friend and family but it's mostly making sure you understand yourself so with that being said let's just do i'm wearing the dancing